Hey, it's Chris here with a Feature Friday. We're going to do things a little bit different. This Feature Friday, we're going to show you three of our smallest, lightest bunkhouses. I'm here in front of the Passport 239 ML, one of my favorite units for a lightweight unit. Um, comes complete with an outside kitchen, an awning that covers the length of it. And a, and a big feature of the Passport is because it's lightweight and you're um, probably going to use a lighter vehicle to tow it. It has a spread axle. They call it load equalization axles. You see the distance between them. Just keep some of the wheel hop out of it. Makes it tow a little bit easier on your SUV or whatever you're towing it with. Let's go on inside. As you can see, pretty spacious. There is no slide for something that weighs 4,250 pounds. Um, over here, here's the bed. This is a Murphy bed. Um, easily, easily drops down. There's your bed. Put the sheets on it. Put it back up with the sheets. I mean, that really just took me seconds to do. Then you've got a nice living seating area. You do have outlets on either side, um, charging ports and everything. Nice hang up um, storage area. Pretty big sink, counter, stove, oven, microwave, all the features you'd want. This could be a bed, but why use a bed when you've got these two? We call these double over double bunks. There's a window in the top, window in the bottom. Um, outlets for your devices in top and bottom. Some great storage under there. Then we have a full-size bathroom with a little tub. Don't want to miss this storage over here. Camper this size doesn't always have a pantry or a full-size refrigerator. So um, again, this is a Passport 239 ml coming in at 4,250 pounds. Let me toss it over to Andra. Hey, thank you, Chris, so much. Hey, I'm gonna take you a walk through of the 17BH Cadet here. It weighs 29, has an LP tank, a 20 pound on the front you will put. Um, if you walk around it, you've got a cubby area here. You got two steps in, which isn't real big, which is nice if you have trouble walking up steps. Right here, I'll show you the 17BH, and this is certified green as well, which is nice for those people with allergies. But hey, come on in. So if you wanted to take a family, this is an excellent coach. If you look right here, here's your bed. You also have a place to plug your phone in in the corner, which anymore, that's very important. Once you see how nice these cabinets are, they got some depth to them. For a small camper, you just about can't beat this. It's excellent. Look at all that storage. Once again, you know, you're just looking at 17 feet here. Um, also, this right here will make a bed. This chair is movable. If you want to take it outside, you can. They also have a plug-in right here. So if you have that desktop, you need to do some work, you can. Here's the really cool thing about this. This right here, these bunk beds will hold 300 pounds. So if you have a heavy kid or an adult, they can sleep in here. Got a bed down below and a bed up. You do have a light back here. So whoever sleeps here, if they want to read before they go to bed, they can. Now I'm going to take you into the bathroom. This bathroom, it's small, but hey, it works. You got the tub here. If you got kids, you can give them a bath. Excellent. Shower curtain, which is great because you can replace those easier than you can if it was glass. Got a little pantry in this. Hey guys, for 2,910 pounds, you just can't beat it. You got your AC above. I believe it's a 1,300 watt. You've got your stove, microwave, sink, and you even got a refrigerator with this. Isn't that nice, guys? You've also got a plug in here for the coffee pot. This controls your thermostat for your heater. You got a little light under here. Hey, let's go camping, guys. You can't beat it. Bring your family and take a look at this little gym. Hey, thanks, guys. I'm going to turn you over to JoJo now, and she's going to take you through a walkthrough on the 176 LHS. Thanks. Hey, thanks, Andre and Chris. This is JoJo here. Um, we are going to do a feature Friday here on this 176 LHS hideout. 2019. Um, first of all, I'm going to go and tell you guys that this unit is 21 feet 5 inches long and it weighs 3,700 pounds. So nice single axle unit here. All right, first of all, we're going to talk about um, three year limited structural warranty, one year bumper to bumper here on the Keystone models. Okay, um, beautiful here, diamond plate 
rock guard so when you're traveling down the road rocks hit it protect your coach let's come on around through here um pass through storage goes all the way across so lots of room for you to put your lawn chairs uh fishing poles things like that to go along with your trip <clears throat> outside also we do have electrical outlet going on oh i do want to touch on the awning on this single axle unit here this awning is electric so no manual going on here let's take a look inside this 176 lhs hideout um does have nice full bed up here in the front oh what's this a slide hey so slide with your single axle unit your dinette does fold down to a bed, so you can put the kids up here. Storage underneath as well, so you can have lots of room to put your things. Um, this unit also has a nice big bathroom in the back. Larger refrigerator. Oh, don't forget this. More bunks for the kids. 13.5 AC roof air. So, hey, once again, guys, this is a nice little unit here. 176 LHS hideout. Thanks folks for watching another Feature Friday. These are some great small bunk houses. Have a great weekend and if you have time come out and take a look at these units. Thank you.